Good morning, my friends. It's Saturday, May 30th, and I'm here with you at the Rising of the Sun, Kate. I got some new reading glasses at Walgreens. <laughs> and my cat is running around. Uh, and I have this beautiful cross that is helping me pray. We continue today in the book of Deuteronomy and Moses tells us that it was the people's idea that he be the intermediary between them and God. So the people came up the mountain and God started to tell them the 10 words, the 10 commandments, and the people couldn't bear it. They couldn't bear the immensity of God, the brightness of God, the power of God. And they, they ran down the mountain and they said, Moses, you act as a, as a person in between, an intermediary, a translator, interpreter. God will talk to you and you can tell us. <laughs> and interestingly, God says, you know, that's a good idea. This is a precursor for Jesus who would also stand between us and God being God though. So God came closer to us. But I find it fascinating that it was people, we ran away from God, it was not God that didn't wanna to speak directly to us. We were the ones who said, when, it's too much. I find that sometimes in the prayer life, I just wanna run away. God is so immense, so vast, so brilliant that it's almost too much to take in. And so the people said, could you write that down? Write the 10 words down and give, we'll stick Moses in between us and God. And it was a good solution for a while, but it wasn't enough for God who loved us so much that God wanted to come in Jesus to be closer. So God said, if I can't, speak directly to you in my omnipresent ultimate creator mode, I will speak to you in the form of my son. I love the idea that Jesus is God coming closer, bending down to speak to a little one, like you would bend down to speak to a toddler, coming to us, speaking our language so Moses was an intermediary, a precursor. And what an incredible man he was to do that for us. Because sometimes God is scary, the maker of this universe. And we need a voice that's softer. Let us pray. Almighty God, we thank you that the people who wandered the desert, the Hebrew people, could articulate their fear enough to ask Moses to stand in between them and God. Instead of running all the way away, they found a, a way to still hear from God, but not be so afraid. We thank you that Moses agreed to do this and that God agreed to do this and we thank you that Jesus would come to bring us even closer. Help us to understand that although the world is crazy and God is powerful, that God is also gentle and wants so much to reach us. I ask you Lord to bless this world Bless the people in the Middle East. Bless those who battle the coronavirus across this planet. Give us grace and wisdom to learn how to be better stewards of these beautiful natural resources you've given us. And help us to treat one another with kindness and respect. This we ask in the name of Jesus, your son, our intermediary, 
the one who can speak to us directly. Amen. God bless you. Have a great day.